Peach, can I come in? I think it would be best if you didn't. Huh? It's over, Justin. I just can't take this anymore. You're always late. You never take me out. Frankly, I think your video games mean more to you than I do. Now, the plumber is coming soon, and I don't think you should be here, so I suggest you leave. Now. Plumbers. What game? Star Tropics. The unrecognized classic. Isn't that the one with the robot that looks like Rob the Robot? Yeah. Navcon. So, what brings you to my underworld domain? Peach dumped me. That's always harsh. How would you know? You've never had a girlfriend. Touché. Anyway, she said that my video games meant more to me than she did. But that's true, isn't it? Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, that's true. So, what's new? Not much. Oh my god, you should have heard Sarah and John today. What happened? Okay. Sarah's talking about this guy named Mike. Wait, Big Mike or Little Mike? Big Mike. Oh, good. <laughs> and then, like, she was saying that she had a crush on him and everything. And then John was like... And he was like, started yelling at her because he thought that she was going out with him. And so Sarah started yelling at John, and then everyone was just like, in shock, and then they started laughing because of her stupidity and all that. John is so stupid, and Sarah's such a slut. They're like, totally made for each other. <laughs> So I heard you drop the Game Boy. Yeah. I mean, I was just getting really fed up. He'd always whisper these sweet nothings into my ear that only really make sense if you were, like, some sort of super geek. <laughs> Plus, he was a really bad kisser. I mean, he was as immature as Pokemon. <laughs> what video game girl would you sleep with? Edgar. What? You're single now, aren't you? Not that my marital status is any of your business, but yes, I am single. Then answer the question. Indulge me. Fine. Samus Aaron. Why? Well, she's strong and tough, but can be sensitive. Like when she spared that baby Metroid. Uh, and you? Tifa Locker. For all the obvious reasons. Are you nothing more than a controller-wielding pervert? Conquer a binge-drinking squirrel? Come on, let's go somewhere that'll lift your spirits. I seriously doubt that. Trust me. on something you know she could never win. It's a good idea. Where do you come up with this stuff? Final Fantasy VI. 
and Slez used the two-headed coin trick on Setzer, and then we really are a geek. Let's get going. What do you want? I have a proposition. A challenge of sorts. Yeah? What is it? A duel. Midway style. If I win, you date me. And if I win? Then... the gates to the Earth realm will be closed for all eternity. See ya. Finish him! I win. Humiliation! She kicked your butt, didn't she? Shut up. Either way, I can't be really safe. Over that point. It's like trying to find the Minus Worlds in Super Mario Brothers. To get to the Minus Worlds, you have to sacrifice an arm and a leg to find something that's not only glitchy, but never meant to be. Just like testing out the thing. Exactly. Swing your arms from side to side. Come on, it's time to go. Do the Mario. Take one step. And again, let's do the Mario all together now. You got it. It's the Mario. Do the Mario. Swing your arms from side to side. Come on, it's time to go. Do the Mario. Take one step. And then again, let's do the Mario all together now. Now, just like that. 